Okay, I can explain. <laughs> Hello everybody, it's Vanilla or Bun. Um, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's been a while, which is what I always start my videos with. Um, however, guys, guess what? It's sketchbook tour time. <laughs> Finally finished the sketchbook. My first ever Loistrum sketchbook. So fun to use. Honestly, I feel like it's gonna be my go-to sketchbook, despite being 40 buckaroos. 40 Canadian dollars. Anyways, I love it. Here are my charms. Uh, my friend made me a charm of my OC Super. Very appreciated. And, you know, gotta be that one Sanrio girl. Anyways, on to the sketchbook tour. So this is the first page. Um, it's just a spread. I'm pretty sure you guys saw this of my OC Vanilla Lucky and Yanta in like a Wonderland kind of theme. Um, I drew this way back in like February. I drew this in January, I think. Oh my goodness. It's actually been so, so long. I'm pretty sure this was before January. Anyways, um, this is so long ago. Mind you, it's October now, so um, yeah, I digress. Here is the practice page spread of Lino from Stray Kids um, kind of studies. Didn't really like it. I tried the post-it note thing, but I didn't really like that method either. Yanta's birthday. Okay, this is February. This is February because I always draw for Yanta's birthday. Whoa, wait. I think, dude, I literally drew for Yanta's birthday twice in the span of one sketchbook. Like, in the span of owning one sketchbook. That's crazy. I, I never expected. These are my characters, Evangeline and Gumdrop. They work in a manner. And then here are more Lino doodles and sketches from my friends from school. They're, uh little doodle page btob guys they have such precious smiles they were so cute i don't know me talking about grown men <laughs> my vent page which i think goodness didn't really render because i only render it during the times where i want to vent through art so um that didn't really happen throughout the course of the sketchbook which was in a very long time here we get to the suggestion moments um more BTOB. Uh, this is from Goblin. <laughs> and my new OC is Sankwa. I made him last sketchbook. Yanta and uh, my friend's OC interactions and Vanilla, my OC. And then I tried gouache. I didn't pick it up again. Actually, I'll pick it up again next sketchbook, guys. Hold me accountable for that. Please, please. Um, this is my OC Ignis because he's a fire guy more suggestions dinosaur girl uh, freaking spider-man came out around this time too vanilla and elephant some guy from a game k-pop guy k-pop girl trio uh vanilla's making them kiss as per usual uh chip my oc kotsu this is the prettiest picture i drew of him like because it's actually so hard to draw him but I actually kind of learned how to draw him, so I'm excited to draw him a little more. And then I think this is Maki. Maki from Soul Eater. Uh, Yanta as a, I mean, sorry, Lucky as a gangster. Pochi is dead. Satoru, uh, my friends, Satoru Rat. Uh, Miguel O'Hara. Uh, Chai Guy. Who is this? Genshin Demon Slayer. Yanta, my baby boy. Lucky Yanta, Yanta Vanilla. You'll see a lot of them. They're my OC trio. This is Super, uh, the person on here. She is a cat girl, if you guys are wondering. And if you guys are into cat girls, I hope she is your standard. And this is Lucky holding his two guns. Uh, his ability is called Bullet Omen and yeah, that's him, guys. And then my OC Mint. I had to revive her. Mo, I did not revive her because she's very um, typical character. Super, I definitely did revive. More friendship doodles. And then Christmas time rolled around. 
it's almost Christmas again. Isn't that crazy, guys? Anyways, um, so this is my uh, Wasura family photo that I do every year for Christmas. This is Vanilla, Nightmare, White, Blonde, and Shiro. It's a small comic based off of an interaction by my friends and then my dear Kotsu because suddenly it was January. Why was it February before January? I don't know if I drew this in chronological order. I'm scared. Guys, I'm scared. Call help. This is Kotsu. He's the love of my life and he's supposed to be intimidating but right now he kind of looks like a mess because uh, of his hair. I, <laughs> I really gotta fix that. Anyways, uh, this is Ray, my fox OC. Kind of furry, half furry. Um, I remember being told about the term for what he actually is, but you know, he he's here. I did not bo be bothered to like draw his tails, but I think I'll paste a little picture of a full body that I made of him, cause I did that too. Lucky. Because I missed him. Uh, my skater boy, or my figure skater boy, OC, Jung, and Vanilla, and Lucky, and Lucky IRL, except not really. Because kind of looks like a girl. Oh no. Anyways. Uh, Yanta, my OC Yanta, he's a gangster, very like tough guy, but he's actually very soft <laughs> to his friends as per usual. So uh, he becomes a very clean guy. He loves giving a little like skinship and kisses to his friends very platonically. So uh, I wanted to draw that because I don't think I've ever mentioned that about him before. More Yanta, I don't like this. More friend doodles, ah! Uh, so my second year of university finished here. And that's all I drew in the second year. All of this is third year. Um, er, third year and summer. Um, but yes. Lucky, more trio time doodles. Trio. Oh yeah. More trio time. Trio at the beach with some crabs. And then I colored this with uh, some markers I had laying around. So that's very fun. Oh, and then um, this is around the time, I don't know if you guys play Apex Legends. <laughs> I have a love-hate relationship with that game, but I'm pretty sure everyone hates it. However, this is when the new legend at the time named Alter came about. I haven't played her, but as soon as her trailer dropped and like as soon as I saw her lobby like uh, stuff, dude, I was actually like in love with her. Like her lobby animations, gorge. Oh, and this is Charles. Um, Yanta sleeping because he a cutie. Um, Yanta on train. Bros being bros. <laughs> and then, okay, guys, I need to preface this. I got super obsessed with like inking again. Uh, that's what I used to do a lot during my um, very, very old like elementary school sketchbook. So, you know, I so, so, so miss. Um, kind of the way I drew in the past or the way I actually had fun with sketchbooks in the past so I decided to like kind of break that kind of limitation that I've set for myself in this sketchbook and I decided to just start inking and I got a brush pen so I decided to play around with that so you'll see a lot more of that and these are um, Winter Summer's OCs uh, from previous pages and more Lucky Vanilla. Lucky's older brother, Honey, he's a masochist. Shiro, uh, Vanilla's younger brother. They're pretty much the same age. Uh, Sasankwa and Kotsu, the story about them is that Sasankwa kinda uh, was there before Kotsu became the headmaster of like the academy. So Sasankwa knew the old headmaster and like trying to get like warmed up to Kotsu. 
Kaori, Cold Sue's younger sister. Oh my gosh, guys. Um, Silly Billy <laughs> FNF mod. Kinda like, yo, kinda tugged on my heartstrings a little bit. So I don't know why. I first watched uh, Inside Out 2, and when I saw Envy, I was just like, oh my gosh, she gives me so much Aquamarine from Steven Universe 5. So I drew those two together. I honestly don't know why. Maybe it's because they're two round blue people, perchance. Uh, I'm being friends. And then the four year, I think, four year anniversary of my webtoon kind of came about during this sketchbook as well. So I wanted to make a spread of Vanilla, the main character, with some nods to the other characters. Um, IQ, the king of the uh, Avum Kingdom, Kotsu, and family, and Daisuke, and um, Nightmare, blah blah blah. Those are characters from my webtoon, The 71 Liars, if you guys are interested. And then more Kotsu because I thought I could draw him. <laughs> and then Lucky? Oh, Lucky being. <laughs> lucky being one of those guys and just being like bodied. <laughs> um, vanilla in a very weird position, but who cares, guys? It's a sketchbook. Ah! And then here are my Kotsu doodles because. I became obsessed with him because I got a red brush pen and I became obsessed. I missed him so much. So I drew him a lot and I think I'm kind of warming up to kind of drawing his design. The reason I'm pretty sure I've said this so many times before, the reason that like I can't draw him is because he's like too, intimid too intimidating of a character because I want to kind of show that aura, you know, a thousand aura, sorry. <laughs> A thousand aura I want to portray that but like you know sometimes he ends up just looking like a very ratchet shampoo model and this is his younger sister I drew her a lot I decided to kind of orient her character towards like loving fashion and just being really cheerful upbeat so she's basically Misa Misa but not toxic and red and that's how I describe her to people who don't know her more Kaori and um these were style studies of Anina Tanemura. You might know her works of like Gentleman's Alliance, Cross, and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I kind of want her style, so I hope and like I am so thankful to anyone who says that my style is very close to the shoujo anime style or manga style because that's my dream, that's my goal. Friends, OCs. Evangeline again. And then vanilla doodles, more vanilla doodles because I recently started to listen to again Egoist songs, uh, yeah you probably know their songs, um, but this is those songs are very much associated with her character so yeah random bubble this is Yanta's gang mate, he's tall and green gumdrop that one nurse person this is what she looked like before this is her younger sister caramel which i also revived as a character and then her other younger sister matcha who i also revived as a character and then i forgot i totally forgot about this character that i made um last year uh for a class it was based off of it was supposed to be based off of a classmate but i turned them into a frog and i love frogs i don't know why but i love frogs i love this guy and alas we have finished it took nine long months i'm pretty sure it was longer than nine months but let's just say it was nine months um i finished it off with a colored pencil piece of my oc trio yanta lucky and vanilla that you've seen this entire sketchbook and we're done that is the sketchbook thank you guys for watching this tour i will be back with my usual sketchbook decorating video and since i love the loisterm so much i spent another 40 canadian dollars so yeah so cool let me know what you think i'll be back see ya